This is a dye pulse oximeter. It is a very important equipment in medical science. Pulse oximeter is used to measure the heartbeat and the oxygen level in blood. In this video, I will show you how to make this dye pulse oximeter at home. Let's see which component we will need to make this project. I will use this kind of PVC board to make the body of our pulse oximeter. Now at first we need to upload the program to our Arduino Nano. Let's go to the computer screen and upload the program to this board. Ok friends now we will upload the code to our Arduino Nano. For that at first we need to download a file. I will give the download link of this file in my video description. After downloading the file we will get a zip file like this. Now we need to unzip the file. After unzip or extracting, we will get a folder like this. Here there are another two folder and one file. This is our connection diagram of this project. We will connect all the components by following this diagram. Now go to the library needed folder and copy all the three libraries. Now go to the documents section and then go to the Arduino. Then go to the libraries folder. Now paste all the three libraries here. I have already added all the three libraries so that I will skip this step. Now go back to the folder again. Now we will open our program file. This is our program. The file will open in Arduino IDE software. If you don't have Arduino IDE, just download the Arduino IDE software from arduino.cc website or search on Google. This is our program. Now at first we need to find out where my Arduino Nano is connected. For just right click on this PC and click on manage. Now go to the device manager. Go to the port section. Here it's showing me that USB serial CH340 connected on COM10 port and this is our Arduino Nano. Now go to the Arduino ID again, go to the tool section, select the board as Arduino Nano from here the processor will be 80 mega 328p the port number will be Comptain because our arduino nano is connected on Comptain. if everything is okay then click on upload button the program at first compile if the program is okay then the code will be uploaded to our arduino nano it will take a few seconds Okay, our code has successfully uploaded to our Arduino Nano.
already collected all the components. Now we will test it. Car and the switch. Now put your finger on the red bit. Okay guys, I hope all of you enjoyed this video. For any question, feel free to comment. If this video was interesting, then like this video and subscribe my channel. See you in next video. Till then, stay well, stay safe.